Hi, if you need to lock records in the Zoho CRM because the records missing some data or data is wrong, so no one can move forward with the record, but at the same time, you don't want to make the field mandatory because it would go and stop the process, this video is for you. This is Alex Weiss at Cornstone Solutions. I'm going to show you how to lock records in the system. But keep in mind, whatever I'm going to show you can work for any other module and field and occasion. Okay, uh, let's start by going to the top right here, the gear icon. Under here, under customization, you click modules and fields. We are going to be using now the leads module for this configuration. Under the leads module, move to the record locking configuration. Let's click configure now. Uh, you have here the option uh, to lock manually, which means like if you have a profile that has this configuration, you would be able to go and lock manually. But let's don't focus on this right now. Let's focus on the automatically locking. Let's check this. We're going to give name to this row here. Lead source is MPC. We're going to come over here and look for a lead source. We're going to add empty. Uh, you could go and uh, make this lock happen to every single existing record if you check here, but last for now, just for the new ones, okay? Let's save. We have this rule here. You, you can add more rules if you want, but let's keep one and simple for now. Uh, settings here below. Uh, you can go and put some exceptions. It means like an admin would be able to move forward without locking. Uh, but let's put for now all the profiles. Restriction in actions. Uh, it comes with edit, but we're going to add also convert. For this case here, you could add more like uh, extra uh, restrictions to the, the record. Uh, fields allowed to be modified. That's the point where we would like, let's say someone add a record and at the, that point, the person didn't know the, the lead source. And, but I still, you would like to keep the, the salesperson move forward adding the record, but at the same time, don't be able to do certain things. Let's put here, lead source can be modified. Let's save and I'm gonna show you how it works. You see here, now we have a, a configuration. Let's go to leads. Let's click create a lead. Let's close this. Let's put Alex, Alex lead. Email, we put Alex testing.com just for now. Company, we put cornerstone. It's gonna show here. And we're going to leave the, the lead source empty for now. Okay, let's save. As soon as I save, you see it comes with this little icon here that the record is locked. If you go to here to the list, you can see it has a little lock here. Let's go inside. You cannot go and make any change. You don't have the options to convert here. The buttons appeared, but you can come over here and add the lead. Let's say I am a salesperson and I add this record, but at that point I didn't have the information for the lead or any specific field. But now I have, I, I got I got this uh, from a Zoho form, let's say advertisement. Okay, after, after talking to Alex, uh, I understand that Alex learned about us from advertisement. And let's click check. As soon as we check, you see the little lock is gone. And now you can move, you can edit the other fields, you can convert. And uh, uh, if you would come here and put none again, you would see it would go in lock again. It means you need to have lead source to be able to move forward with this record. This is a very nice way to kind of uh, keep all the data in the system, make sure everyone's filling out all the information, but at the same way, don't block someone because you could have done like put this a mandatory field, 
But uh, as you make this mandatory, and let's say I'm filling out the record and some, I don't have this information, I wouldn't be able to save the record or I would put any aleatory uh, information here that would go and become wrong later. Okay, and keep in mind, like in this case, lead source would be fantastic and very helpful for the marketing department. If you have any questions about the uh, locking records, or if you'd like to learn more about Zoho or Zoho One, uh, contact us. It would be a pleasure to have a conversation. Have a nice day. If you found this video helpful, be sure to like it and leave us a comment. You can also subscribe to our channel and click the bell next to the subscribe button to be notified of new videos. If you want to learn more about Zoho or would like help with anything Zoho related, head on over to our website at zcrmhelp.com to connect with us. Thanks for watching.